Every college athlete's challenged in a special way, no matter where you go to school, no matter what Division I program you go to, or any, any college program for that matter. Doing it here is, is special because there's a lot more responsibility that comes with that. West Point's a different animal. The tradition here is unbelievable. The Army basketball team, just a small, small picture of that. I feel like we're playing for something that's larger than just the game of basketball. It means a lot more than just basketball, being a college basketball player. You're part of the greatest team in the world, being part of the U.S. Army. Just kind of like a rush when you when you put the jersey on, you see Army on the front, you know that it stands for something bigger. I wear it with pride and I'm happy to do it. It's something that I have a privilege to do. I love coming up here with the guys every day and working as hard as possible. It's special to us because of obviously what happens down the hill. A lot of things are tough here. Going through it with all these other guys that we're so close with has really helped us. We've been able to lean on each other and just support each other throughout all the hard times. Most times we're out there together. You really rely on other people around you to get you through. We've built that in the prep year that we had and it's kind of carried through the whole way. It just makes basketball a lot easier and it makes us also understand how much we love basketball and how much we love sports and just how bad we want to be able to win here and take that away with us. It's just the, the long gray line, but a little more, little more tight-knit group of guys that always support you no matter what. We can go to each other be like, man, today's rough, but we'll push through. Even if you have a bad day, you know, they got your back, both the people that are here and people that have graduated in the past. You've seen so many great leaders come out of West Point and just to be following in their footsteps is very humbling. Generals in the stands and all kinds of alumni show up here, former military, family of military members, and you just want to prove something to them that you're there and you're going to do everything you can, not just to win a basketball game, but so that they can have trust and faith in you after basketball when we're in the Army and that we can lead the sons and daughters of America in whatever conflict we may have. You got to think back to all the greats that have been here, like Mike Krzyzewski and Bob Knight, both coached here. Coach K played here. Kevin Houston, one of the greatest scorers ever. When we put on that uniform, we're representing not only ourselves, but them. Knowing that you're standing for the same thing that they stood for. Not just representing the school, but representing the entire Army as a whole. While we show it by playing basketball, it's a bigger meaning behind it and we're just trying to prove ourselves as leaders of character, not just basketball players. Go the extra mile for you know the guy next to you. Trust, knowing that I can rely on my teammates that they're gonna come through in the clutch and then they're also gonna trust you. If they need you to make a play, you're gonna do it. The way I play kind of correlates with what I'll do in the Army. It's kind of like the down and dirty stuff. Stuff that doesn't really get recognized on the stat sheet, but the little plays and stuff that hopefully I have big outcomes on the game. I think it has done tons of things to prepare me for my military career. Getting to know each of our teammates translates to getting to know your soldiers when you graduate from here and you have your own platoon. I think it's really important to get to know each of your soldiers and, and know what motivates them. Being able to work hard, come in every single day and give it your all is just very important and I think everyone on our team has shown that they've been willing to do that. I'm really just grateful and thankful that we have men and women out there serving right now. I just take pride in knowing that hopefully I'll be able to go out there and lead them and be a part of the greatest team in the world, and that's the Army. We're all aware of that, and we're trying to, you know, enjoy this moment we have and these last, I guess, few months of college basketball we have together. Being able to finish the journey together is definitely the most fulfilling aspect of it. You know, just make memories and make history ultimately.